friends, welcome back to another video. I'm so excited that you're here with me today for my Amazon back to school must-haves. I feel like this is such a good list. I spent so many hours on this yesterday just combing through Amazon trying to find things that I thought were really helpful for getting us prepped for going back to school this year. Even though we're gonna be finding ourselves in different situations depending on the state and city and all that kind of stuff that we're in. So this is good for homeschool, for going back to school in classes, for online school, and it's good for a ton of different ages. So I found stuff for high school lockers, I found stuff for preschool. It's all a mix, so if you have any age kids, this is a video for you. Also, I wanted to mention, if you haven't yet subscribed to this channel, make sure you take a second and just hit that red subscribe button, followed by the little bell for notifications because YouTube is so special and it does not notify you if you just subscribe. You have to hit the bell for notifications. So make sure you do that before you head out and let's get into the must-haves. So the first thing on my list is a calendar and weather pocket chart. This is for a younger age range. This is so that you can learn about calendars and days of the month. Actually, my best friend just ordered this and got it and showed me and I really, really like it. It just seems like a really cool tool to show your kids the calendar and the weather. So some of this stuff is going to be mainly for organizing because I feel like as a parent right now, especially with homeschooling or online school, there's so much that just needs to be organized at the house. So I put in one of these file folder organizers that has like a ton of tabs. It was in the homeschool section of Amazon and I feel like it would be perfect for a parent with multiple children in school like myself. I didn't even explain that in the beginning, but I do have, I have three kids. Two of them are school age starting this coming school year. So it's gonna be very interesting, but I'm thinking of getting myself this file folder because it has so many tabs in it and then I could put like the different um, subjects for each of my kids in those tabs and it could all stay organized. So the next item on my list are these math link cubes and they are just good for younger ages to get to know math and learning about how to add and subtract and things like that. And it has super high reviews on Amazon so I just wanted to let you guys know that everything that I talk about in today's video is like either Amazon choice or or best choice or things like that because I wanted to insert only options that are really really good not just like random things that I found but like things that have really high reviews so these math link cubes have really high reviews and a lot of them okay the next item on my list are these educational preschool posters you can just hang them on the wall I don't know if you are doing homeschool if you have like a homeschool corner or like a homeschool room or an area that you're going to put for your kids to do their schoolwork but these would be really cool to hang up and kind of learn different things in like a fun, visual, bright colored way. So I really like these posters. I think they'd be perfect for my five-year-old son who's starting kindergarten. So the next thing on my list is the storage center and I feel like it's perfect for homeschooling or online families. And it seems like the perfect thing to have just so that you can reach and grab things really easily. It has little compartments for like pencils, pens, glue, tape, anything you can think of you can put in this little storage center. Okay, next up is one of my most favorite things that I found and it is this locker decor and organizer kit. I love this. I don't know why they didn't have this back when I was in high school or middle school, but I feel like this is the cutest little thing. It comes with like a little shelf, it comes with a mirror, it comes with a whiteboard, it comes with something to like hold like pencils or pens or like little trinkets in and it's all magnetic and it can be put um, like on the walls of your locker. So if you have a middle school or high school kid, this would be perfect. It has super high reviews on Amazon and um, it's super cute. The next thing on my list is another favorite that I found and it is for lockers as well. It is a chandelier. Oh my gosh, <laughs> like seriously, I am so excited about this. I don't have any kids in high school or middle school, but I do have a niece and nephew who are in high school and middle school. And I feel like they were talking about chandeliers for your locker and I thought this was the coolest idea. This is for kids who are going back to school and who are a little bit older. If you're interested, 
I say just splurge and be a little bit extra with a chandelier in your locker. The next item on my list is for back to school kids and this would be for somebody older who has PE. So it's just a gym bag. It's the Under Armour gym bag. It has crazy high reviews on Amazon and it just, it comes in like a million different colors and designs and so if you're interested in a gym bag i'll make sure and have that linked below so the next item is for back to school kids and it is just this really cool lunch box it's like a bento box i don't know if you guys have heard of those but they're really popular these days they just have a million little like compart not a million i i don't know if you guys can tell but i tend to exaggerate a little bit but it has several little compartments in it to put like snacks or like ranch dipping sauce or Whatever it is that you want for your kiddos, it has like different little compartments. So I found this one, it has great reviews and it comes in a bunch of different colors. Now another thing that I wanted to share with you guys are these little hand sanitizers that you can attach to your backpack. Again, this is for kids who are gonna be back to school and I just feel like this is so important to have these days in our current situation. I feel like it's so important to teach our kids the hygiene necessary to keep healthy. Part of that is having hand sanitizer on you at all times. The next item on my list is these V mini water bottles. They have really high reviews. They have a straw that comes and like pops up. They have so many different colors. They have amazing reviews. And I just feel like I need like a sturdy water bottle to send with my kids to school, at least from my experience, because they get used so much, they can break so easily if they're just plastic. So this looked like a really sturdy water bottle to send with your kid to school. So the next up on my list is this umbrella for kids and it has super high ratings on Amazon. It has different colors that are available for like the polka dot part. And I feel like it's so important to get our kids these little umbrellas, especially depending on where you live in the country. Most kids end up having to use an umbrella at some point during the school year. Next up, I found these hot food jars and I feel like they are so cool for taking like soup or anything that's warm, like noodles or whatever it might be to school. Sending your kids to school with something besides a sandwich is a nice option to have. Next up on my list is this really cool thermometer. It has really great reviews and it is just one that you can point at the forehead. I don't think you even have to touch the skin. It takes your temperature, which as you know is really important during this whole coronavirus situation it's great to have one of these especially for kids who are going back to school just to make sure that your child is safe and healthy and doesn't have any kind of temperature or fever when you send them off to school the next item on my list are these kids face masks again this could be for kids who are at home or going back to school because anytime you go out in public you are required to wear a face mask at least where i live i know that a lot of other states it's not a requirement but if you do feel like you need one i wanted to list a few different options for kids and teens face masks so i have a few different linked down below so the next thing I found are these youth and kids headphones and they are just really high quality. They come highly reviewed and they just look perfect for kids who are trying to learn from home and maybe there's multiple kids learning at home. Like for me, I think I'm gonna get these for my kids because there are two of them and they're both gonna be online learning from home, trying to figure out like what their teacher's saying and I don't want them getting confused because they're probably gonna be sitting next to each other. So I just thought it'd be really good to have like a quality pair of headphones that goes over the ears because the little ones that goes in the ears seem to not work well for my kid's age. So the next two items on my list are these dry erase markers and this whiteboard. And I thought this would be perfect for anybody doing homeschool or online school at home. This is perfect to hang on your wall, to help teach your kids, to help um, write things out, whether it be the alphabet or math or different things that they're learning in their classes. Now I wanted to include these next two things on the list. These are definitely pricier items, but for kids who are gonna be learning at home, I feel like this is kind of essential for many families. So if you don't have 
a laptop or an iPad available for your kiddo and if your school doesn't offer it to borrow I wanted to include it on the list just because I think it's really important to have one of these items available for your kids so I do like the Apple products so that's what I included in my list but there's always the option to get like a Kindle or a different brand but I just included what we already have and that is like a MacBook Pro and an iPad so like I said earlier in my video, I want to include items that can help us as moms or dads, whoever's watching this, to stay organized for our kids in school. And one of the things that I thought would be really helpful is this wall calendar. It's actually a whiteboard. I thought this was perfect to get everything up on the wall that's gonna be happening for the month, whether it be kids assignments or whatever it is that might be school related or you can use it for family calendar or whatever. This would be perfect to just have on your wall and to just keep your family super organized. Okay, here's another one for an at-home learning family and that is just a desk. So I wanted to include a desk as an option. I searched for ones with like little compartments that you could have space to put stuff in, but that still looked like it could be a part of our furniture in our home. And so I found this desk and it has really high reviews and it has like little compartments for um, like books or pencils or pens or whatever you might have. That is a really good option. It comes in different colors and I thought that it'd be perfect for a family who needs a little space. The next item on my list is this label maker. I love this label maker. I want to buy this for sure for my family. It comes with different font types and I love that. I wanna organize my whole house with different fonts and <laughs> I feel like it would be so much fun. So if you are in need of a label maker, this is a great way to keep things organized. The next item on my list is an art caddy and I feel like this is amazing for keeping things organized as far as art goes. So my kids are really into arts and crafts. We have a bin that is designated for arts and crafts supplies. There's tons of little compartments to put paint brushes or stickers or glue or whatever you might have for your kids for arts and crafts. This would be such a great thing. It has handles that you can pull and carry it like to different places in the house. I just thought this was perfect. The next item on my list is for families who are doing at-home learning and that is just a timer. It's really basic, nothing super fancy, but it's just a timer. Clock your kids if they need to hurry or if they need to take a test or whatever you might need it for. The next item is a bookshelf and I wanted to include this because I feel like for people who are staying at home and having a space for their kids to be learning at home, if you have space for a bookshelf, I think it'd be perfect to get it for the house just so that you can have a place to put your kids' school books and notebooks and papers and like if you get the art caddy or different things like that that I've suggested, you could put it all on this bookshelf and it could just all be holding things that would be for your kids' schooling. Here is another organization item and it's just for over the door file organizing. So perfect for getting things out in the open. It's just another option for organizing stuff for your kids and their schoolwork. This could be for any families with kids in school, whether they be at the actual school or if they're at the house learning. Either one, this could be a really cool option for organizing your kids' schoolwork. All right, so we're getting close to the end of the list. So this one is just book bins. This would be perfect for organizing things by class maybe. So I know that for us, we have different classes for our kiddos and they have separate like books and notebooks that could go for that class. So maybe you could organize each class with a book bin and then maybe use the label maker to kind of like um, label each book bin. I don't know, I'm just thinking off the top of my head. Okay, another organizing option is the storage organization cart. And I love this because it's on wheels and you can move it around and you can pull out the drawers and you can put different things inside of them. If you would rather have 
things um, held inside drawers. I think this is a super good option for you. Just again, another option for organizing at home. So this is one of my most favorite things that I found. It's called a surf portable lap desk. It has amazing reviews. There's one that's really expensive, but I found one that's like a cheaper option and it's not that expensive and it seems like the perfect thing to have if your kids need space to do like desk learning at home, but you don't have desks or whatever. So I have two kids who are going to be in kindergarten and in second grade. And so I'm trying to figure out where I'm going to put them. So I think this would be a really good option option for me for my kids so that they could both have separate desk learning spaces and yeah I just thought this was so cool because you sit on it and it's a desk and it's all in one. Next thing on my list is this homeschool family planner. This is actually the last item I'm going to be sharing with you guys. It's just a way to get everything organized that is going on for your kids for school all in one book. So I know I've shared a couple of options for like the wall or things like that, but this is cool because it is just in a book form so you can sit down on the couch and kind of write out everything that you need to be doing for your kids. And I thought it'd be a really good way to keep things organized and concise and like a way that you could just look at a glance and figure out what needs to be done. Okay, lastly, I know I said that that was my last thing, but I wanted to share with you in the description box some of the items that are just like the normal things that you need that everybody needs, like school supplies, like number two pencils, colored pencils, construction paper, all that kind of stuff. I have it linked down below. I have the highest reviewed items on Amazon linked. So if you are in need of things like that for your kids, if you have your school supply list yet, then you could go ahead and just buy everything on Amazon because it's a great way to not have to go into the store and you don't have to go shop around and you don't have to expose yourself or your family. It's just a cool way to kind of like get your shopping done with a click of a button. So I wanted to thank you guys for watching another video with me. Make sure you give this a thumbs up if you felt like it was helpful or if you liked any of the ideas that I came up with. Let me know down in the comments what some of your favorite items were or things that you think you might need for your family. And again, don't forget to hit that red subscribe button on your way out and I will see you guys in another video. Bye guys. Hey, feels like I've been